refer to the following conversation. I heard on the news last night that they're starting construction work on the bridge soon. Beginning next week, we'll have to drive the long way around to work. Oh, no. That's going to make our commute time even longer. It already takes us an hour to get downtown. But we only have to put up with it for the next three months. After they expand the bridge to four lanes, our commute time should be cut in half. Number one. What are the speakers mainly discussing? Refer to the following conversation. Is there anything I can help you with today, ma'am? Yes, I'm looking for a gift for my niece. It's her 18th birthday. Do you have any suggestions? Well, these purses seem to be popular with teenage girls, and they're 25% off today only. Thank you. I'm sure one of these will be perfect for her. Number two. Where does this conversation take place? Refer to the following conversation. Hello. I took one of your taxes this morning, and I think I left my cell phone in it. Okay, sir. Can you tell me what time you took the taxi and where you were headed? Hmm. It was around 7.30. I was picked up on Fifth Avenue near Grand, and I went to Central Station to catch my train. Let's see. It could have been any one of about five drivers. I'll call them all to see if anyone found a cell phone in the back seat. Number three. Why is the man calling? Refer to the following conversation. Hi, Stan. It's Marie in accounting. I've been put in charge of our end-of-year party, and I don't know where to hold it. Do you have any ideas? Well, last year we had a great party at the Cool Seasons Hotel. The food was terrific, and everyone had a great time dancing. I don't really know of any other places. You could call Barbara in marketing. She planned the parties for several years before me. That's a good idea. I think I'll ask her for some ideas. Number four. Why is the woman calling? <laughs> 